In the heart of the vibrant city of Progressville, there lived a young man named Daniel. Daniel had a remarkable talent for seeing the negatives in every situation. If the weather was too sunny, he complained about the heat. If it rained, he grumbled about getting wet. Even his friend's achievements weren't safe from his cynical remarks. Daniel's knack for complaining had an insidious effect on his life. He had a tight-knit circle of friends who were all hardworking and ambitious. Each time one of them achieved something significant, Daniel's remarks turned their joy into hesitation. His toxic attitude created a silent wedge between him and his friends, who were tired of his negativity. One day, Daniel's friends decided that they couldn't stand idly by any longer. They knew Daniel was better than this, they had seen his potential, and so, they devised a plan to confront him in a way that would help him see the destructive path he was on. During their next gathering at a local cafe, Mark, one of Daniel's closest friends, took a deep breath and began, Hey Daniel, you know we care about you a lot, right? But we've noticed that your constant complaining is affecting everyone around you, including yourself. Daniel initially bristled at the accusation, but took a moment to absorb what Mark was saying. Sarah, another friend, chimed in. When you complain, it's like casting a shadow over all the positive aspects of your life. It blinds you to the opportunities that lie ahead and pulls you deeper into a cycle of negativity. As the conversation unfolded, Daniel began to see the genuine concern in his friend's eyes. He felt a mix of embarrassment and gratitude for their honesty. He decided to take their words to heart and embark on a journey of self-discovery. Over the following months, Daniel actively worked to change his perspective. He started by focusing on gratitude. Each day, he reminded himself of at least three things he was thankful for. He began to notice the beauty in the little things, the warmth of a cup of coffee on a chilly morning, or the laughter of children in the park. As Daniel's mindset shifted, he also began to reflect on the impact of his complaints on his relationships. He reached out to his friends with heartfelt apologies, and made a commitment to be more supportive of their endeavors. He realized that by embracing positivity, he could be a source of inspiration rather than a drain on their energy. Slowly but surely, Daniel's efforts began to bear fruit. He pursued new hobbies, rediscovered his passions, and even started volunteering at a local community center. As he grew, so did his confidence, and he started to see the effects of his transformation ripple through every aspect of his life. One day, while scrolling through social media, Daniel stumbled upon a quote that struck a chord within him. Your thoughts shape your reality. He realized that by dwelling on complaints, he had been shaping a negative reality for himself. But by focusing on the positive, he was rewriting his own narrative. As the months turned into a year, Daniel's friends couldn't believe the change in him. He had gone from a chronic complainer to a beacon of optimism and support. His own successes were a testament to his newfound mindset and he celebrated them with a genuine joy that he had never experienced before. Ultimately, Daniel's journey taught him that complaining not only robs us of the present moment, but also has a ripple effect on our relationships and opportunities. By choosing positivity over negativity, he had transformed his life and the lives of those around him.